Thank you for joining us today in support of these talented performers. A sincere thank you goes out to all of the instructors, parents, teachers, friends, and families. You have all helped to make this a very special day. Give yourself a round of applause. We would like to take this opportunity to acknowledge the individuals who, through their tireless efforts and dedication, have contributed so much to the success of the season. The WGASC Board of Directors, WGASC Executive Committee, the Operations and Administrative Staff, the Judges, Contest Staff, Judges Coordinators, 2023 Contest Partners, the Advisory Committee, and the Reclassification and Promotion Committee. It truly takes a village, and we are so grateful to all of you. In 2020, today's seniors were freshmen, many of whom had just started their journey in the performing arts. That year ended abruptly, and we were all left uncertain about if and how we would find ourselves back on the gym floor doing what we love. Those freshmen turned sophomores, turned juniors, and are now the seniors that lead our ensembles today. Seniors, we want to recognize the hard work, dedication, and tenacity that you brought to our activity. Please step forward. to see all that you will do. Friends, family, and fans, let's give them one more round of applause. recognizes the 
young performers participating in our activity who also pursue academic excellence. The WGASC has awarded over $150,000 in scholarships over the past 30 years to selected students who excelled in outstanding academic accomplishment and commitment to further their education at an institution of higher learning. This weekend, that tradition continues. In conjunction with our 35th anniversary, WGASC is excited to present a total of 35 academic scholarships this season. Award winners are spread across all of our show sites over these two weekends of championships, but the recipients from today's group of ensembles are from Pacifica, Andrea Soriano.
Okay, medalists, now that you have your medals, pictures taken, please go back into the block. Okay, in eighth place, with a score of 69, a .16, Royal High School. In seventh place, with a score of 69, a .57, Tesoro High School. In sixth place, with a score of 71.59, Quartz Hill High School. In fifth place, with a score of 73.46, El Rancho High School. In fourth place, with a score of 75.59, Azusa High School. In third place, with a score of 78.34, and the recipient of the bronze medal, Redlands East Valley High School.